Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I'm going to show you how I customize my iPhone with iOS 14. First, I'm going to teach you on how I did this calendar in the upper part of my phone. And then I will going to show you how I put a photo right here with a quotation. And third, I will going to show you how I change my icon or the icon on my application. So there you go guys. This is my first page, second page. And as you can see, I customize every page based on the app that I'm using or I'm sorting out every application that I'm going to use. Like this one, this is all the apps that I'm using with my finance and bank accounts. So here you go. And then right here on my third page, I just put a photo with a quotation and right here a photo again i chose the car right here because my apps right here are basically related for traveling and car services so before we start i'm going to show you my screen record right here at the left of my screen and this one my phone in the right so you can see everything clearly i'm going to show you how i did this widget first you're gonna do is to download the widget smith there you go this is what it looks like so after you download the widget smith you can have a small widgets right here uh, medium widgets and large widgets let me do a sample for you guys sunday and you press it so you have many options right here if you want a date date only day month and day and you have an option to choose the photo and if you click it and select photo choose photo and there you have it you can choose what photo you like and then save don't forget to save it guys i will press this one to pop up the edit home screen and then you click the plus button and you will see the widget smith right here and then add widget for the small and then choose the small number six because that is the photo that i chose recently and there you have it so that's how i put the photo or the widgets on my screen for the calendar go to widget smith and then select the medium widgets add medium widgets and then click and you can have the options to choose what you like there is a option if you want to um, click a photo or display a photo for example this one and then you can edit the fonts so I chose the chalk duster for the tint color you can choose pink red purple so you have many options to choose background color so I like the pale pink and then for the tint color I chose the black and then I can put a border color white pink red so I chose the white and then save it you can choose if you want to have a photo so what i do right here is all the apps on my phone i move it to the app library for decluttering and last how i change my icon photo we need to go to the shortcuts and then plus sign and then add action scripting and then open app so 
you will going to choose what do you want example open my Pinterest okay Pinterest and then add to home screen and then you will change the shortcut name and then press this icon you have the option to um, put a photo choose photo so I'm going to click this one the icon of the Pinterest and then add and there you go you have a brand new icon right here for the Pinterest so I will be going to put it right here so that's how I change my icon for every application if you're going to ask me what I'm going to do for the apps that has a shortcut or that has a double icons on my phone like this Pinterest and this one the original Pinterest so you can edit home screen and you can move it to the app library so it will declutter your um, iPhone I have a tip for you all you need before you start this customization on your iPhone is you need to download all the photos or the inspiring photos that you want or the theme you're going to do on your iPhone on the Pinterest app example for this one I'm going to download the image so I can use it on my widgets and to be honest I'm not yet done editing and customizing my phone right now but yeah I will show you on the next video because I'm going to do a what's in my iPhone or my updated what's in my iPhone video using the iOS 14 I really love the update of this iOS because you can customize your um, iPhone like an Android user so here's the final design for customizing my iPhone I just put a photo right here a static girl and then on the second page for all my banking stuff and then for the third page this is what it looks like for the fourth page and then on the middle part I put a aesthetic wall of paper so this is a medium widget these apps are my go-to apps or productivity apps that I need and if I'm going to edit my pages I just click the dot button and I'm hiding a one page click done so it will appear on my pages so these are the random pages and folders that I have and I hope guys this video helps you to customize your phone so thank you so much guys for watching this video and don't forget to click the subscribe button below and like this video thank you so much guys for watching and see you on my next one bye